सो हाइड्रिया सेजिटेरियस अ वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू यू गाइज दिस इज अंजलि टैरो एंड दिस इज अ जनरल लव रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द सैजिस एंड मून इन राइजिंग Keep in mind, this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, the roles can be reversed. Also, third thing, this is a reading from today till the next seventy-two hours. It can go up to four to five days. So let's start your person or your partner's current feelings for you right now at this present moment. Let's see. Sages, we have the six of cups and the judgment and the five of wands. Bottom of the deck is the page of wands. Okay, so uh, you guys have a history together. It could be very much possible that you guys are not talking to each other right now, or there is misunderstandings or a break uh, or break kind of situation going on. Someone feels like they should come towards you with this uh, light-hearted and beautiful approach of uh, having a friendship kind of energy and starting from scratch kind of energy. Someone who is having a connection with you, a deep-rooted connection with you. They feel like a soulmate, a deep-rooted soulmate kind of connection with you. There's lots of love in the situation, and they feel like. Uh, letting go of the drama and the fight and issues whatever is going on between you guys mm -hmm. and they feel like starting from scratch giving it another chance you guys have a beautiful history together mm -hmm. it's not uh, like this is someone new or someone newish at least 6 months you guys are together at least from 6 months and uh, uh, even if you are uh, like with each other only from 6 months you feel like very deep rooted uh, past life connection also with the person okay and they feel like okay If you are always going to fight for fight on uh, trivial issues on stupid issues it's never going to be the same as it used to be so someone here is uh, uh, like uh, uh, feeling like they should let uh, go of the drama the fight the competition the unnecessary kind of energies out of the situation and bring the uh, energy of uh, harmony and love back in the situation and having this flirty and light hearted kind of energy in this situation okay this is what this person is feeling Let's see what this person wants from you. What are their intentions for the situation between you and them? We have the Hanged Man, the Queen of Cups, and the Star card. So, bottom of the deck is the Queen of Swords. Okay, they want to see things from a different perspective, and they want to have. Uh, this energy of self love self care and self healing so that they can heal the situation between you and them okay they want to heal the situation between you and them and they want to be they want to remain very optimistic that uh, everything is going to be fine with time this is just a phase and this too shall pass this is what this person wants an optimism an optimistic energy okay this person wants to see things from your perspective as well and they want to uh, give you time and space so that you can heal from whatever issues are going on in the situation and so that you can understand that you guys have a soul kind of connection with each other and this is something very deep rooted this is what they want it's it's a very loving and caring and nurturing kind of energy that this person wants you to like wants uh, both of you to understand each other's point of view as well and understand that this is not something casual or this is not uh, something that is like uh, today it is there and uh, uh, tomorrow it's not this is something that's uh, huge for them for you and they want to give it a beautiful chance beautiful healing and they want to remain very very clear in the situation clear, crystal clear in the situation they don't want add, to add any kind of confusion or drama or issues very beautiful intention right now about this situation hmm. let's see what could be the outcome of the situation between you and this person till the next 72 hours or 4 to 5 days let's see sagis what's coming towards you we have the 7 of swords the 10 of wands and the 7 of cups hmm 10 of cups what more so you will get to realize something a secret is going to come out it could be possible that you are self sabotaging your own happiness because you yourself is creating scenarios that are not even valid and you are self deceptive like okay i'm not in love with them i don't want them i am just uh, okay without them i have lots of options in my life and it's stressing the hell out of you sagis okay so you need to understand that there is something that's coming out to light okay sudden realization about yourself or it could be very much possible that you will get to know something about this person's nature or characteristic that is going to put you on this uh, uh, like uh, in this burden some kind of energy okay i have to look for other options in my life because this nature is not acceptable or this characteristic is not acceptable on this is very heavy and burdensome so let me open up to other people and other situations or let me keep my options open 
so right now i do see secretive energy is coming out and it's going to put you in some kind of burdensome energy either from your side or from their side or both of you are going to realize certain thing about the situation about each other and it's going to you this this is going to make you feel stressful about uh, the future direction of your love life you will be very confused what you should do and what you should not do in the situation okay and under pressure you will be in this energy of okay let me look for other options too because i can't i can't rely on this person or i can't rely on the situation <laughs> that kind of energy i'm picking for you for the next 72 hours so you are confused whether this is your happily ever after or not and what you should do about it after knowing something about yourself or about this person or about this relationship or realization or uh, some kind of uh, things coming out hmm so let's see what is the guidance for you people sagis in this situation we have the 9 of swords justice and the 9 of pentacles right now the right thing to do is focus on your individual growth and happiness okay the more you are going to stress out about how to get the right thing how to get things right in your life especially in your love life the more you are going to get away from the uh, things like from the right things no see stressing over something that you cannot change is not going to change it you have to change yourself you have to change your perspective and uh, the way you think about that situation okay right now your overall focus on uh, focus should be on your individual happiness individual growth in every area of your life once you are going to be stable in your, in your energies especially in your finances and in your stability uh, like emotional and mental stability you are going to find the peace within yourself you don't have to do anything else uh, like about this okay so stop stressing over things and places and situations that you cannot change okay because stressing over things cannot change it doing something about it can change it and what you can do right now you should just focus on yourself and uh, uh, let them be whatever they are doing just let them do it okay just set them free okay once they are going to realize all the necessary lessons that they should and uh, once uh, it is going to be settled the air is going to be settled this stressful energy is going to be corrected itself you don't have to do anything about it hmm. we are responsible for for our own energies and our own things not for everyone out there okay so thank you so much for tuning in sagis i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste